Hi guys, what's going on? It's the Digital Tutor here with another step-by-step -step tutorial. In today's video, I'm just going to show you how to change the Windows 10 start button. Uh, this does also work if you're using an older version of Windows, like 8.1 or 7. And if you do find this helpful today, please leave a like and drop a comment below. If you are new to the channel, don't forget to hit that subscribe button for more step-by-step -step tutorials, how-tos and tips and tricks for everything tech and digital related. So the start button is actually down here in the bottom left hand corner. It's this little windows symbol down here, where obviously if you give it a click, it's gonna bring up all your programs and apps and things like that. So to actually change this, it's really simple. What you wanna do is come across to google.com and then you wanna search for a program called Classic Shell. And it's just gonna be this one at the very top. Um, so you just wanna go ahead and open that up and then just click the download now button down here. And it's a very small download, it's only a couple of megabytes, um, about six megabytes. So what you wanna do is download the installer. And you can see that's downloaded down there and then just go ahead and run the, the setup wizard. So I'm just gonna uh, install that. So you just wanna hit run and agree to the permissions. And again, it should only take a second to install. As I said, it's a very, very tiny program. Um, so just go ahead and click next, and then next, and then install. Okay, so you can see it just takes a second or two. That's just going through and installing. And you can see that's now ready to go. So what we're gonna do is go ahead and make sure we, you can view the readme file if you want to. If you don't want to, just make sure you untake the box and then click finish. So obviously you wanna make sure you've got a image downloaded ready. And to actually install this and use it, what you can do is um, search for it in the search bar. So uh, you can see it's loaded up straight away, but what you can do is obviously come down here and just type uh, classic shout. And obviously you'll be able to find it there or obviously click on the start button and find it in the programs. And then what you want to do is basically come down here and click this box here where it says replace start button. And what you can do is it's basically set it to arrow. So you can see down here in the bottom left hand corner now, it's changed it to this image here. But if you want to choose your own one, what you want to do is click the custom icon down here and then click pick image. And then you just want to go ahead and locate the uh, your image. I'm just going to do that now quickly. So let's go for this one here, for example. Um, so obviously this isn't going to work fully properly because it's not set to the right resolution. Um, I'm literally just using this as an example. But yeah, this is basically what you would do. You would just come and choose your image. It's like this one, for example. And then once you're happy to go, all you wanna do is come down and click OK down here. And you can see that's changed the um, start button. Sure, it's absolutely fine. Again, these images are showing up a bit funny like this because I've not put them to the right resolution. So you just want to make sure the resolution's right before you actually use it. Um, but yeah, that's basically how you do it. So I hope you did find that helpful. If that did help, please leave a like and drop a comment below. Don't forget to subscribe to the channel. And if you do want to help support the Digital Duty channel, there is a link in the video description down below. If you go and give that a click, you'll be able to buy the team here a cup of coffee. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next one.